happy draft day. Shout out to all the NFL fans watching the draft so the team can get better. I know my team just got better. Detroit Lions, what up, though? Today is Saturday. Today is the fourth round. So, hey, I think the first day on the first round was a little iffy for me. Like, bro, what you doing with these picks? But then, you know, you got to trust the process and wait. And that's what I did. And yesterday, the second round, wow. That's all I have to say. Wow. I'm excited. I'm happy. Can't wait for the season to start. Now, back to fishing. This Saturday morning, on the way to the beach. We got a couple hours. The weather's gonna get ugly. It's supposed to rain. So, I'm gonna try to get out there before the rain comes in. So, we got cooler full of ice, shrimp, fish bites. I got ladyfish for cup bait. So, yeah, stay tuned on what the beach has to offer today. Right here guys, small pieces, look, look, just like this, look, one shrimp, we got six pieces, this is all you need to give them. Here we go, let's get some sand fleas guys. We need that pompano candy. Here we go. Come on. Here we go. That's a good start. Your feet. Oh, oh, oh. The same fleet is already working. Look, we got a pump on in here. Ooh, he went slack. Ah, he's still on there. Oh, oh, oh. It's definitely fast. Ooh. Up, up, up. He's shining down there. Yep. Here we go. Pumping no. Oh yeah. Look at this guy. Alright, alright, buddy. Take it easy. We were just talking about you. We we're saying how much you love the sand flea. Come on, we'll put you back. All right.
still on there. It's still on there. It's going sideways. It's going sideways. This guy feels heavy. It's definitely a keeper, whatever it is. It's a good size. It's very fast. Very fast. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's what he was. Yep. Pump no baby. Pump no. Alright. Look at this beauty. Alright. So far. We're only using shrimp and uh, sand fleas. We're not using the ladyfish right now because they're keeping me so busy. So we're gonna stick to the shrimp and the sand fleas. A lot of our hits have been on the upper hook on shrimp. It doesn't seem like they're uh, in the appetite for the sand flea right now. But hey, we got plenty of shrimp. If shrimp, that's what they want, then shrimp they're gonna get. Oh, we got a runner. aggressive Bump no, baby. <laughs> Look at this guy. Woo. What a fight. <sighs> what a fight. He hit hard, didn't he? What is that? It's called a pump and no. Yeah. Congratulations, man. Hey, thank you. Thanks, our, ocean, our first ocean fish. I've yeah. And this is the best one, too. That's your, okay. Congrats, my man. Thank you. Yeah. It looks like it smashed pretty hard. Oh, man. It smashed it real hard. I think they'll turn back on here pretty soon when the tide turns back on. And they're going for the shrimp too? Yeah. They're not really going for the same thing? I just got the last two. Going sideways. Watch it be a little shark. Oop, oop, oop. Oh man, it's too shallow right there. Come on, buddy. Oh yeah. Upper hook, shrimp. That's 
crazy. I've been, I caught the first two on shrimp and then the last three have been on, on uh, sampling. Man. That's definitely a keeper. Yeah, yeah. Hey, thank you, man. Yeah, no worries. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> we are casting in the fish's mouth, guys. That's what we're doing right now. Loved it. There was one exciting fight. That was on that small rod right there. Oh man. We casted that one right in the fish's mouth, guys. That's the whole key. You gotta cast it right in the fish's mouth. We got sand flea, we got shrimp, fish bites. We're loading them up today. Now, for me to get to the Pompano, well, I, am, I am walking through all this right here. That's the only way that I'm able to get to them right now. And I think that was the third Pompano. The first one was undersized. And the last two were keepers. But I had to walk all the way over here. Because you can have the bait, but if you're not casting where the fish is at, it means nothing. There we go, guys. Right in the fish's mouth. Let's do this. I see dolphins out there. Could this be a whiting? Haven't seen a whiting today. It's been Pompano City all day. Whatever it is, it's quick. Small jack. Here. Yeah. That's jack number two. What kind of fish was that? That was, that was a jack. A jack? Yeah, Jack Carvel. Because the yellow tail is so yeah. pretty. Mm -hmm. okay. Usually the pompano have the yellow tail too. Oh, okay. So that's what the fishermen fish this beach for, the pompano. Oh, how big do they get? They get pretty big, yeah. uh, but you can't keep them uh, unless they're at least 11 inches. Oh, I see. So it has to be 11. Yeah. I can show you, I actually have one in the pool. How long have you been out here? About two hours. Oh, okay. This is oh, the pompano. Oh, wow. yeah. Look yeah. at that. Yeah. Now is that so, is that like a white fish? Like when you cook it? Oh no! Flaky? It's, uh, no, it's not flaky. No. Oh okay. No, no. It's this is probably the best fish. Okay. That you can eat out of this ocean right wow. here. Wow. It's very hard to get. Is yeah. it? Yeah. yeah. But okay. if you ever go somewhere to buy them, like Restaurant Depot. Yeah. And they got the red eyes, don't buy those. Those oh. are farmed raised. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, so, so the wild, so wild ones don't have it. Yes. Yeah. So what kind of taste would you say it has? Because I don't think I've ever eaten one. Though. I'm not really sure how to oh. describe the yeah. taste of it, but... You just like it. It's the best, man. <laughs> like, especially, I'm, right. I, I make tacos out of these. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. man, I'm yeah. telling you. All right, we'll, we'll let you get back to it. Thank yeah, you. thank you. Sure. Yep. The pompano hit, and they hit fast. We hit about four pompano, three keepers, and now the bite just died out. 
So we're waiting for the bike to turn back on and just enjoying the beach, having my coffee and minding my business on this beautiful Saturday. But nobody here fishing though. The beach is empty. Look, nobody fishing. And we catching the pompano. That's what it is. Oh, oh, oh. I think the bite is turning back on. Probably catfish. Feel small. Nope, it's a pompano. Here we go. We're gonna put this guy back. We're gonna let him grow. He looks small. But look, back to back hits. It is. We're gonna put them back. We're gonna have them race. All right, guys, ready? Steady? All right, go. The catfish losing. Pompano is gone. How's the fishing report on this side? Nothing yet. Nothing? Are you uh, scooping any sand fleas? Here and there. Yeah, yeah same here. Ones. Here and there. But the pompano, man, they were going after the shrimp today. Yeah, I started with shrimp and I started using sand fleas right now. They didn't touch my sand fleas. Really? Okay. Yeah, I hit about five or six pompanos. Gotcha. Okay, cool. At least three keepers, but they all went on the shrimp on the upper hook. Okay. So, switch back then. try to load them up on shrimp. Back. Yeah, good luck. Yeah, usually I, you know, I rely on the sand fleas <laughs> yeah. like you, but today was the opposite. Okay. Pumping up in the cooler. Oh yeah. We cast it right in the fish's mouth today. We got them pompanos in the cooler, baby. We let some go. And some got off the hook. The water conditions, beautiful. So get out guys, bring the shrimp with you, cause they were in the mood 
for shrimp today. Get out and fish. Tight lines.